sure I can't make you a coffee. I've got a machine in the cupboard with pods. Oh, no, you're all right. Sophie not around today. Well, I'm expecting her to bob in at some juncture, but she's a law unto herself, that one. I must say, I didn't expect a legal professional like yourself to come running round here at the drop of a hat. Don't you have an underling who can do all paperwork and whatnot? I just needed you to sign something, but annoyingly, it doesn't seem to be in the file. Mm. Well, that's the danger of multitasking. You end up doing ten things at once, and all of them badly. That happens to all of us. Hi. Oh, hi, Soph. Hello, Sophie. How are you? Yeah, I'm really good, thank you. Could I just use your loo? Yeah, sure, you know where it is. Oh, and you must let me know what you think about my new pedestal mat. It's from John Lewis. OK. A pedestal mat? Who even has one of them in 2018? Well, as long as men urinate standing up, Sophie, I do thank you very much. Anyway, never mind that. What do you think about Paula making any excuse to come round here? What do you mean? Well, it's obvious, isn't it? She's hoping to run into a certain someone. Your dad. I think she's taking a shine to him. So he said... I shall love you and leave you both. I'll just get my stuff together and I'll be on my way. All right, I'll speak to you later. Bye. Bye. Fancy a spot of lunch? I really love to, but I've got to go work. Oh. Well, maybe I'll pop in for a working lunch and see if I can distract you. Mm. So, yeah, my last girlfriend kind of put me off relationships for a bit. Was she that bad? No, no, she was lovely. I was mad about her, but she fell in love with someone else. Oh, oh there she is. You know, I had your tip jars. Sally Metcalf have a little thieving hands all over them. Well, God forbid I should stand here shouting out a list of all your crimes and be here all day. It's for more. Hmm. Oh, hi. Can't keep you away today. <laughs> What's all this? Nothing. We, um... Well, we just... Sophie was a bit worried about your court case. So I just thought it best to take you through it step by step. Oh, Sophie, I'm sorry. I didn't feel you could talk to me about it. No, honestly, it's, it's fine. Mm. So you don't have to worry, cos I've got it all in hand. Well, why don't I join you? I mean, you finish your shift in a minute, don't you? Yeah. Well, better still, why don't we decamp to the bistro? We can open a bottle of red wine and have a right good chinwag. <laughs> 